You guys need to see this, so come with me. This here is my collection of unboxed rements and figurines. So today, we're going to go through one of them. The box we will be going through today is called Our Home. So I got this on one of my trips in Japan, so it should have all these cute little components in there. And it cost me about $40, but don't be fooled, I've seen this for $27, so you can definitely get it cheaper than that. I'll list some links in the description box below of where you can find it. But yeah, since we're getting the whole set, we should be getting all this cute little stuff. So without further delay, let's break the seal. So here's our background that we're going to deal with later. Let's get to these boxes. So this first set seems to be a vegetable... Wait, is that beer? Could be beer. I think it is beer. <laughs> so let's take them out. We have some deep fried stuff, some lotus, I think, if I'm not mistaken. It's mistaken. And I think this is cabbage or pickles. Now we have some beer from Pucci Brewery. The details are glorious. It's actually really pretty. And then we have a fan that it's actually pretty loose on the inside. And I don't know if we can get it to spin, but... It's loose in there, so that's pretty cool. And here's the full set in this cute little box. And in each of these little boxes, you get the description of what's in there, but you also get little flyers and magazines that you can cut out, fold over, and put them in the design of the place. So I'm gonna cut this out. Poochie White by Dr. Poochie. Ah, dang it. We have the table. Foot massager is my guess. Some good reflexology right there. Actually feels really good. <laughs> Old school phone. Oh, that's, that's pretty snug. And a cute little cup from Nimpoland with Puchi Zo Kun. Little ninja thing going on there. Pretty cute. And we have, I think, I think it's a juice. Cutouts for this are a napkin or tissue box and a flyer. Here's my absolutely terrible <laughs> Kleenex box. That was harder to put together than I thought. You have to like fold in some origami stuff. Yeah, I don't have that origami dexterity. And the flyer. Oh my god, guys. Containers with food. Look at that. Look at that. That's some, some Ziploc stuff right there. Oh my god. Does this come out? Oh, <gasps> it comes out. So we have a little curry. Chicken curry, it looks like. Or it could be tofu curry, whatever you want. And we can close it here. And then, was this a little rice? Look at that. Cute. And we can seal it that way. <laughs> there we go. Then we got a heap of salad. I have no idea what this is. If you guys know, let me know. Salad dressing. This is cute. And I think this is a filer, which works too. Office supplies, I think. This cute little thing is from Puchiyama Bank. So it's a bank booklet with your account, debit, and all that stuff. So don't forget, this is in Japanese yen, so they may not seem as rich as you think.
Man, these cutouts are really elaborate, so <laughs> let's try to make this box. Dang, Nabbit. Phew. That, that took longer than, than I would have liked. And I cheated. I used tape <laughs> instead of just glue, because this is just how I roll. I don't know about you guys, but every family has a box of these to use them for sewing stuff. I know, I know I do. I don't know about you guys, but usually they're blue, I think, these cookies. Poochie Blend Coffee. Let's put the coffee inside. This is so cool. I love these sets so much. Let's close it up so we don't lose some of that freshness. And it stays. It stays, guys. It stays. And then we have a drink that, ooh, that didn't make any noise whatsoever. <laughs> we have like this white drink. I don't know if you guys know Calpis. And I'm saying Calpis, not cow piss. This is not what you drink. <laughs> but in this set, they have something called Putty Piss. So this is pretty much their take on Calpis. And you can wrap it because this is an actual sticker, but I do not want to wrap it. I actually want to keep the bottle and guess why? Because I want to make a mold out of it. Oh my god, this is the budgie set. So first we have this cute little radio. This goes up. Does this open? No, that was ambitious. Does this open? Ooh. Ooh, this opens! Maybe this does too. Maybe I'm just... Oh, it opens! Oh, now I know what this is! It's a little CT! Oh! That is so cool! Okay, I'm super impressed with this one. Let's get... Let's get this... Here, so we have the little antenna. We have the little thing here. So now I know what that thing was because I was like, what is that? So this is the, what's it called? CD case, it seems like. Now we have the cage. Does this, oh, oh, this does, okay, this does open. So we could put the little budgie in there. <gasps> so cute. Look at the little budgie, by the way. Look at that little budgie. Can we put him there? Oh, <gasps> he does. Kind of, kind of, budgie, stay. Budgie stays. Okay. Oh no, Budgie took a nap. <laughs> Budgie's rolling over. <laughs> okay, so Budgie's in there. I'm gonna have to work on Budgie's feet. And we have this Ooh, sliding door. Sliding Budgie door. But Budgie can't get out of here, can you, Budgie? No. Nope. Budgie's playing, guys. Don't, don't worry about Budgie, he's okay. I decided to let Budgie hang out outside of his cage. So in this set, we have some... Ooh, they're all functional drawers. I love these re... Yeah, big fingers. <laughs> I love these remit sets because the pieces can be used. So if you make mini clothes that can fit in here, that's your thing. And we have another retro phone. Yeah, old school phone. There you go. This one seems to be wireless. Doesn't fit, but it'll fit. It'll fit now. Ah, dang it. It's okay. It's still okay. It's still okay. <laughs> and this is a... Mosquito or fly swatter. It's pretty flexible too, so we can smack that mesquite. Oh, that comes in different pieces. Oh, TV! Alright, so something looks really cool about the TV. Ooh, in that it has a screen protector, which means that the cutouts that come inside actually stay behind the screen. How neat is that? Now, how does the screen stay on there? So it's not a clip. There are two little tiny things here that you just put into the little holes and it stays. Here's the TV stand and Armageddon. My dad has exactly 
one of these. Wait, does this fit inside? No, I don't think so. <laughs> that was a little, a little too ambitious. It does not fit in there. It's weird. In this box, we got a panty and sock hanger with socks. <laughs> so we can put our laundry out to dry. Oh no, I almost broke it. Yeah, don't be as rough as I am, guys. So we can put socks. And if you have mini panties, you can put mini panties. <laughs> Let our socks out to dry. Last box. The first thing we have is a potted plant. It's pretty cool, actually. Wait a minute, let's... Okay, there's a hole in here, which means... Oh, is that the thing that I saw? Wait, where is it? There, nope. Where is it? There it is. Okay, so, a water control thing. Oh, yes, it's a fit. So this is the thing that controls how well watered your plant gets. Oh my god. Why the details? A cute little spray bottle. I have no idea what this is. So if you guys know what this is, let me know because I don't know. And I thought maybe it belonged to the lint roller. Oh, okay. It belongs to the lint roller. <laughs> we also have a cute little stand that takes on the futon or carpet smasher to let out all the dust and things. I know this because, ooh, this is, okay, have a stand there. I know this because we have something similar like that in Egypt. And the cutout was a cute little kid's uh, crossword puzzle. I suck at crossword puzzle. I probably couldn't even do one for kids, guys. There you go. So here it is, all done. The diorama that came with the box does not fit every single piece of furniture. So as you can see, I have a bit of them right on the side over there because it's just way too small. I absolutely love this set. When I saw it, I absolutely knew that I had to get it. I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. It was so much fun. It was different and I really enjoyed it. So let me know if you did because then we could do some more of that. Thank you so much for watching guys. I'll see you in the next one.